JavaScript is great. It's what powers most of the web. But when it comes to performance heavy tasks like 3D rendering, video editing, and running game engines, it starts to fall short. These types of applications need more speed and efficiency than JavaScript can reliably offer. But what if you wanted that kind of performance and still want your app to run in the browser? Believe it or not, the browser can handle it with WebAssembly. WebAssembly, or WASM for short, is a low-level bytecode format that runs in the browser. But here's the twist. It's not running JavaScript. Instead, you write your code in languages like C, C++, or Rust and compile it to WebAssembly. That compiled code then runs in the browser at near native speed. It's what makes tools like Figma, Canva, AutoCAD, and even some Adobe apps feel so smooth despite running entirely in your browser. With Wasm, you get the power of native applications but without any plugins or installs. It's fast, secure, and portable. WebAssembly modules are also sandboxed, quick to load, and can be dropped into any modern web application, but it's not replacing JavaScript. It works alongside it. So your app's UI might be built in a JavaScript framework while the heavy lifting like image processing or rendering is handled by WebAssembly. And it's not just for browsers anymore. It's also used on the server side and at the edge where you need fast and secure code execution close to users. What makes it so appealing is that you get low level performance, memory efficiency, fast startup times, and small file sizes without being tied to one vendor. It's literally a web standard. So if you've ever thought to yourself, wait, how is this even running in the browser? Well, there's a good chance WebAssembly is behind it. Follow my codes for more programming videos like this.